Hey Gingerbread, where is the fat man? I think he is still in the house. What eating cookies and drinking milk? More like pizza and porn. With a beer chaser. This is what happens when she leaves before the big night. He goes nuts. By the way, what are you doing here? Who is managing the toy factory in China? I left that new foreman, Mr. Lee in charge. What happened was the fat man showed up drunk and started giving orders to load the sleigh. I can't really blame him. If I had to live at the North Pole with Mrs. Claus, I'd drink too. Are you kidding? Why do you think they call me Blitzen? Do you think we should tell him this is the wrong night? I don't know. He seems so happy. What's the harm if Christmas comes a little early for a few kiddies? I only filled his sack with enough toys for Canada. I mean who will notice? Just as long as Fox News doesn't hear about it. I guess no one in the States will really care. As long as they get their iPhone and HDTV in time for football. Anyway from what I read, Christmas should really be in April or May. That is supposed to be the time when the kid was born. Blitz, don't even joke about a thing like that. What would Santa and Christmas be without winter and snow? The fat man ain't no snowbird. But what about South America and New Zealand? It is summer there. If Christmas is supposed to happen in winter, how come we aren't delivering packages in July? Not to mention Panama Beach in Brazil which has no snow, but Santa seems to spend an awful lot of time there. You should see him in a speedo. Come on Blitz, give the guy a break. Even the fat man has needs. I mean really, he goes from house to house, up and down all those chimneys, delivering toys, making all the boys and girls happy. After a night like that, doesn't he deserve a little beach time and then a massage? It's not that I blame him or begrudge a happy ending. But we are the ones on the roof waiting. We are tired and have sore muscles too. Isn't there some place where a tiny reindeer and Santa can relax together? My guess is there is a place like that, but only in Thailand. When the fat man comes up for air, I'll mention they are having a two-for-one special on deep massages at that place he likes in Bangkok. Great, now all we have to do is get rid of all these toys.